I think. Hey, hello, everyone. Yeah, I can share some. I can share something. The yeah, the, the I post the the IOU RAM based uh, use use based block layer driver. Yeah, uh, it actually is very simple. It's based on the IOU RAM command patch, but that patch isn't merged yet. And uh, once the pet the IOU RAM command patch for support NVMe pass through is merged, we can uh, we can post the patch. We we can we can post the patch in the mail list. But actually, the Git tree has been shared. Uh, the driver the driver actually just doing very simple things. It's uh, the first one is the uh, communication between the USB and uh, the driver. It forwards the request. It's actually a block multi uh, block multi queen driver. It forwards the request to the use space by the IOURN command uh, because it's very efficient. Uh, this way is very efficient. Uh, so far, no polling is used. It's just to send the uh, request to by the IOURN. And uh, I think it's the one uh, one thing I found is that it's 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 uh, if the batch is because the IOURN batching is uh, um, makes a diff makes a big difference on the uh, performance. Yeah. Uh, another thing the driver what the driver doing is that the data copy. As we discussed in the mail list, uh, the zero copy is in so far the, the memory management code doesn't support the uh, zero copy. Uh, and uh, I saw the guest from the Alibaba has posted some patches, but still not, still can't work. I tried to use his patch, but it can't work. Uh, yeah, I think that's the basically two two main things done by the driver. Uh, the, the this driver does nothing about the specific use space driver logic, and all the logics are done in the use space. Uh, in the post in the post patch, I just implement the loop. It's just it's like the kernel loop. Uh, from my test, a simple test, the, the, this this uh, use space driver's performance isn't bad than the kernel proof uh, with the uh, direct I/O. I mean, the kernel loop enables the direct direct I/O. So Ming. I've been benchmarking uh, your code in comparison with NVD, and I got uh, quite, I, I, I'm seeing quite impressive speed ups in comparison with NVD. In particular, because since uh, I'm using also the server that you provided, uh, which is, a, a, as I understand it, uh, it's single threaded. And uh, it's, uh, it seems to be quite an improvement with uh, over NVD multi-threaded simply by dropping all the all the overhead from the network. So I, I wanted to ask you in particular, maybe I'm jumping the gun, but in particular regarding multi-queue support, do you see that as uh, obviously multi-queue on the, on the block layer side is implemented, but do you see that as a requirement for getting it upstream supporting multiple queues for the, for the driver? And if you have any ideas on the design to implement that? Uh, I think it's it's pretty it's it shouldn't be hard to support a multi queue for the driver. Uh, so far, we we use one that that the dedicated demo use this demo for one for handing one uh, so, uh, request from one queen. But if 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 with the uh, if the multi queen uh, it's supported that we can create one thread, USB thread, for handling the request from, from one queen. I think that's a basic uh, 
uh, idea. But but because the uh, the in the use space, I actually the the current loops in play is hand I was hand is due it's due down by the IOU. I mean the in the user space part, uh, the request is hand handed handled by IOU, which actually uh, I think most of times uh, maybe one thread one IO job of or two or three is enough. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We don't need much cleans because it's a uh, uh, it's AL. It's IOU and one can um, maybe most times can saturate the the banking device, the banking file. But I, I think that that's that's uh, that's easy to do. That that shouldn't be hard to to do. If it's if it just need, I'm, I'm, I think it will be needed in case of some some drivers which has has need more CPU, uh, which takes more CPU utilization in the use space. Yeah, I can definitely see. Oh, is this working? Yeah, I could definitely see the the benefits of multi queue, but I think like. Uh, from the tests that we've seen, like just like multi queue, uh, I I want to separate out the, the the basic of the driver multi queue and uh, zero copy. Is I think even without multi queue or zero copy, there's still a lot of CPU savings, um, and I think there was also some latency savings over something like NVD or other uh, kind of network loopback uh, device drivers. So I'd really be interested in in seeing if we can get a base version in. And then I think there are obvious enhancements that we can work on in the future um, or in parallel. Um, just, I think like we've, you know, we've been using a similar, um, but based on legacy um, user space block device. And we've we've seen the same savings uh, over, over something like NPD or other loopback devices involving the network stack because there's just a lot of uh, CPU saved um, uh, doing the IO processing. So <laughs> that's my opinion. Yeah, yeah, I think yeah, yeah, yeah. The NVD takes extra uh, CPU in the in the uh, I think the in the socket communication and uh, mm -hmm. and I will the the simple simple IO urine is is very I think it's much efficient that than yeah uh, the socket yeah. Yeah, actually, I'm 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 also looking at the uh, the Camu copy on red image. I tried tried to support that in the use space driver, but still, uh, I'm just working on that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, if that's if, if that's work is done, we can compare the uh, the use space uh, 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 driver with a Camu MBD mm -hmm. because that's a very because these two drivers just do same things. Yeah, I also tried to test the Camu MBD with IO urine option. It still this looks the performance isn't still not good. Uh, maybe mm -hmm. the Camu MBD can be improved. The Camu MBD has supported IOU run option already. Are they support? Are they doing the actual IO transport over something like IOU ring, or is that a interface to just talk to the MBD device itself? No, I, I mean I think they sh they should use the IOU ring to submit IOs to the to the host to image. Oh, I see. Okay. Yeah, there is option on the KMU MBD. But the stuff I think is the uh, once the the patches are ready to post, I mean the the IOU and command patches are merged. Mm -hmm. I think the, we should focus on the uh, interface between the kernel and the use space because this part is the KAB part. It's the K ABI things. 
and we need to make we need we need to solidate this part so we can support lots of drivers in the use space. Also, I think there are lots of things to do in the use space. So regarding the interface with user space, I guess the big part missing there beyond um, an implementation for zero copy would be the multi queue support. Is there any anything else on the interface that still that still needs to be discussed from from what you're proposing, from what you you have in the patches right now? Uh, I think it's the, the interface is integrated with the memory uh, zero copy or all, all the copy, data copy, because both are done inside the driver. The, actually, the use of this is uh, invisible to the data copy or okay. zero copy. I mean, the, the communi communication part between the kernel, between the driver and the, uh, and the use base, because there are some data uh, command definition and the, their commands uh because this part is hard it, once it's uh, merged it can't be changed it can yeah. it's, it's, it's it just can be extended uh maybe we should need some provided the version the driver's version or the usb version uh to do yeah i mean this this kind of thing yeah it's not related with a copy or their copy or better copy uh, because when because when the request is delivered to use space, the use space just can use the um, can just use the memory for read mm -hmm. uh, for write the memory the dirt has been in, in the use use space uh, memories for read uh, the the use the driver needed to copy the dirt to the to to memory and each each bunk of memory is associated with the one request because it's a multi queen request per driver and the zero is a very limited requests it's the queen depth mm -hmm. the so far the driver just supports the 128 requests So we need into any lock inside the driver, inside the use space, and uh, once the once the request comes, and uh, it, it it just being handed, each request can be handed without any uh, sync. Yeah. You also mentioned batch submission and completion. Are you are you suggesting that we could have an a single command completing multiple requests, or how how would that look like? Uh, so you mean the uh, you mean to the benching? Yeah, batched submission and completion. I saw your latest patch that uh, moves the the submit the data copy to the task struct, but. Uh, are you are you planning anything else for batch submission and completion that we could assist with? Oh, uh, sorry, I, I'm not sure I understand your point. <laughs> I, I'm asking. Uh, I'm saying that right now we need uh, two I/O ring commands to submit uh, each request to complete each request. Right? We need a fetch request that can be done. That they, they get data in line through the task uh, in the text task. In the task context, and then you need a second I/O ring command to from the UBD driver to from the UBD server to complete the request. I'm wondering if we could be able to complete multiple requests in a single completion event, or if that is not necessary since I/O ring the cost of executing I/O ring commands is much smaller than executing. System. Of course, it can be done in this way because the, uh, actually. Uh, if you see the late seam, the gate tree I have and the uh, I have in the, late, in the uh, latest 
uh, she I have used the, the task work and uh, to do that. In this we can can actually the driver can add lots of requests. And uh, once the user base is waking up, uh, the, the the user base UBD server can get lots of requests. And then these requests are handed, uh, such as they can be handled by the IOU ring from the user base. And once all this is completed, actually the uh, they will be most times. I think most times they will be completed at batch. And once they are completed, the, this result will be uh, will be will be uh, will be handled by another command like the I forgot the name. It's a uh, it's a uh, it's due sent to the kernel with a batch. If you choose that, you will find that. We can add some statistics inside the inside user base to, to observe to observe this uh, benching honey. Yeah, I think we can add the, this debug statistics in the future. You you, you will see that most times they are they handled by by bench. Okay, I saw your your latest patch on moving moving the data. Uh, the data writing to the to the task context without the get data command, but I, I haven't been able to to make mark that yet, and I, I want to take a look at the, at the new patches. I saw you you pushed the branch uh, this week. I, I want to take a look at that and collect more more data on it. Um, I I got a. Is there any any other? I think we're running out of time. Is there any other? Things that we should discuss. I, I would like to continue this discussion with you, and uh, I don't know if maybe we can schedule another time or. Uh, I think I can answer your question. Your uh, you mentioned that the right moved to the uh, to the um, use base context. The reason is that it's it's very efficient to to, to pin page in the current. Uh, context, uh, you can see that that change in the, in the driver. I, I looks at uh, the it, it saves much CPU in this way, and uh, with uh, also in the in the in the recently I used the task work and uh, we we needed to the another command to like the uh, COVID get dirt command and that command. Isn't needed anymore, but it's still we can do that with the task work add. Just one thing is that task work add is the is 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 an isn't a exported symbol. It has to be used in the driver is built built in the built into the kernel. But I think it's isn't a big deal because this driver will be a very thin driver. It's just do very simple things. It can't be very big. Yeah, we do we. We we won't move the logics, the user base logics into the driver. We just do the okay. communication things and the data copy. This driver can okay. be very small and small, so I think it's, it should be fun to to be just to build into the uh, kernel, so we can use the task work and and, a, okay. and uh, the communication can becomes a bit uh, simple too. I think we are at the top of the time. So, do we have more time, or uh, we're we're out of time? But we have plenty of time on the schedule later this week. So, if uh, you guys take it offline and, and we can't figure out, you can't sort anything out, we can add another slot for it uh, probably tomorrow. So, so that sounds good. Okay. Okay. Sounds perfect. Thank you. Uh, thank you a lot, Mink, for the for the work you're doing. I think it's been okay. quite. Quite interesting to see exactly what we were looking we were looking to implement. Okay, so if, if we need any further discussion, we can and a new slot maybe tomorrow or Thursday. Yeah. yeah. Just email me. Uh, we'll figure it out now that we have the, the Zoom okay. sorted out. <laughs> so uh, I haven't been able to get a hold of Tim 